The jab to the body is one of the most unused punches in boxing, but it drives me crazy because it's such a good, effective punch when used correctly. And on this video, I'm gonna explain the jab to the body and tell you why you should be using it to have success in boxing. And also at the end of the video, I'm gonna show you a clip of one of the pound for pound best fighters of all time using the jab to the body to have success in knocking someone else. So stay tuned for the end of the video. The jab to the body, as you're seeing there, that was a pretty powerful shot. And the way I got power into that was by stepping and getting my weight behind it. I'm gonna talk about that in a second. But first I wanna talk about when will you throw this jab to the body? Because if I'm in the ring with you and you throw the jab to the body at me, I can see you're open for the cross over the top. Hey, look at this, I've threw it to you. Look, I'm wide open for that overhand right. So it does make me feel pretty vulnerable when I do throw this punch. And that's the reason why people don't throw it because you, you feel wide open when you are throwing it but when you start throwing it correctly like I'm going to show you with speed and accuracy that is when you're going to have a ton of success with it for example when I was throwing the jab to the body when I was in fights I used to think about me defense before I threw that because I know I'm open for that right hand over the top so I would make sure I'm not going to get caught with that punch and if you're expecting a punch coming at you the chances are you'll not get caught with it so what I mean by that I'm here I'm out of range I would go for speed Speed rather than power like I showed you earlier on I'm here and I'm out so you see that again watch me feet I'm in and I'm out I'm out of range I'm stepping in range and I'm stepping straight back out it's faster like that and that's going to really confuse them especially if you're doing what you should be doing which is throwing jabs to the head I'm jabbing to the head I'm moving around we're throwing that nice jab to the head, I'm moving around. Then I might feint the jab to the head and go to the body, which is another way to have success with it. Think, if you're not throwing any jab to the body, he's not going to expect the jab to the body. Throw a jab to the head, throw a jab to the head. Feint the jab to the head, his hands are going to come up to block it. Whoa! Step in with that jab to the body. Now, when you do this throughout a fight or a spawn session multiple times, I'm up, I'm down, I'm up. I'm down. He doesn't know what's going to come. He doesn't know what to expect. Especially if you're throwing other punches inside from the hooks. Your punch variation is high. So when you are throwing that jab the body, you want to step with it. If I step with it, bah, and think about speed, the speed of my step is going to get the punch faster. So I'm here, I'm here. And again, you've got to be really fast with it. Bah, yeah. You see the speed there? That was a fast jab to the body. Now, why would we throw this punch? Again, like I said, it's great to throw it to keep him thinking, but this is an amazing setup shot. And I'm gonna show you a clip in a second, but what I used to love to do, I would used to throw that jab to the body and moving around, throw that jab to the body and moving around, feeling that jab to the body, whipping in that big left hook, and it looks like this. So I'm here, jab the body. Jab the body. He thinks I'm going to throw another jab body. Realistic feint because I'm stepping and I'm moving and my eyes are looking at his body. Whoop, bah, big left hook to the head. Now that right there is a key to this is when you are feinting a jab to the body, you've got to do everything that you would do as if you were throwing the body punch. If I'm throwing a body punch, I'll look at the body. I'll really exaggerate it. So I'm one or two steps ahead of him. So I'm here. I look at the body, I throw the punch. I'm here, I'm here. Look at the body, throw the punch. I'm here, I'm here. Look at the body, feel the punch, bum! Blast that big left hook. Okay, now I'm going to show you a world champion doing this and talk all about his setup and how he knocked out another amazing fighter by using the jab of the body. But first, I want to tell you about this bad boy right here. This is the Lawnmower 4.0 from Manscaped. Give your balls a trim down there and keep you hygienic. You know, most men, especially if you're like me, we kind of lack to our groom and we don't really take care of ourselves as much as we should or as much as women should where some guys are doing it all the time i really wasn't until i heard about manscape and i got the lawnmower 4.0 now i'm making sure i'm trim and i'm looking good down there which makes it better for my wife and also what comes with this is the ball deodorizer some cream that you can rub on your balls your groin area to keep you smelling good and hygienic when i'm sweating like i am right now 
now I'll get in the shower, I'll get out, I'll put the cream on and you know I'm smelling fresh for the rest of the day. And Manscaped is a company that I've loved for a long time and what they're doing for all my subscribers is going to give you 20% off. So if you're a man and you're watching this or if you've got a man in your life who you love with Christmas coming up, it might be your dad, your brother-in-law, your brother, your best friend or your son if he's old enough. This is a product I highly recommend. Go to manscaped.com forward slash boxing. I would highly recommend you get this package from Manscaped. It's great. It comes beautifully presented and it's a product that I guarantee you whoever you're buying for will love it. So check it out manscaped.com forward slash boxing and get 20% off this. I'm sure you'll thank me later for it. Okay so let's get into this with the world champion and the world champion is Canelo Alvarez and he's fighting my friend Amir Khan and what he was doing for most of the fight he was doing what I said from the jab the head from the jab the body from the one to the head from the jab the body from the jab the head from the jab the body like keep doing this throughout the fight and I think it was the fifth round where you know Amir was so used to that jab of the body coming Canelo finna the jab the body Amir Khan's come out to try and block it and from there the rest is history and it was good night here is the clip tricky style Click here next, where I'll break down all of Canelo Alvarez's best knockouts, like I did with this one, I'll do it with the other ones. Click here and check this video out next.